all they're gonna do is get on your hip, and when you start to use the screen, they're just gonna push you off your line, right? Yeah. So if you're under and I'm kind of over this, like right. this, if you start to push me out, there's so many options we, we can do because he can just slip and run, run off of it. But right. this is actually more difficult to guard. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Because right. cause of the angle, because I can go right downhill. Right. If I'm like this and you get on my hip yep. and you start pushing me that way, I can't go this way. I can't turn it. Okay. So I'm under him, right? Yeah. And I'm pushing. You're just right pushing me this way. Okay. At least when I'm here, right, from here, even if you're pushing me, I can start curling this and still get downhill a little bit. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So there's not, it's, it's not right or wrong, because uh -huh. it could still work this way, but right. I want you to be able to do both, you know? Because yeah. this, if you get good at this too, obviously, if you keep pushing me, yeah. I can try to keep you under the screen, right? Uh -huh. But then it's kind of easier to jump. Yep. So right now, just go, go right even with the screen almost, and just go. Okay. One, uh -huh. Army. If there's no contact, he was here, right? Yeah. You don't have to create contact. The screen's here. So Maddie, sit, up, sit up more flat right there, right? That's my screen. I don't need to engage with him. Okay. If there's no contact and that's a screen, go. Okay. Because he's got to make a decision. If he jumps over the top, you can refuse it, right? Gotcha. There's no need to engage. He's already almost even with the screen. I'm going off this right away. Okay? I know you're taught to, to body, but if he's not on you already, you don't need to keep bumping him. Okay. Right here, just use it. If he's on you, then change your angle. Okay. Go, go, go! Good. Not bad. Again, right step. Uh -huh. See how you kind of dug a little bit? So you're here, in, and then you're kind of out off that. I like that. Okay. All right, so if he's giving you the step, just take it. Got you. If he jumps it, punch this foot, and come off of it. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's right, left. Like now like this. Let's do it without the defense. You're here, jab, right, left, spin off. Let me see one. Jab it. Yup. Guard it. Jump it. Jab. Good. Solid. Good. Screen, screen, screen. One, two. Come on. That, that. One, two. And then drive off that left foot. Hit it. Good. Not bad. He's low in his stance, right? right? This is what you did. Get low. If he's jamming you up, you, can't, you don't want to do this. Okay. All right? So if anything, I could go, go engagement here with that, with, that off, with that active foot here. Okay. Create a little separation. Can't be fast, though. So you can go in, lean slow, come off of it. Okay. Let me see. Yeah. Get into his body. Slow lean. Yeah. Not bad. Have Put okay. this, this active foot between, their, between the legs and then just... Slow. He, not, he can't take a charge. If I hit his ass like this, that's a charge, right? Yeah. If I go this and then just lean forward, my weight goes forward, now I can play. I have some space. Right. All right, so be patient off of this. Good. Last Good. Last Let's go, girl. Yes. Permanent pivot. You pivot off both feet? Do you, though? Because a lot of people tell me they do, and then I watch them in the game, they never use their other pivot foot. Let's go enough. Okay, so then play normally here. All right, that's your pivot. Okay? Yeah. So you don't want to turn like this, obviously. Right. Okay, so if anything, you can keep the dribble active. Just open your shoulders up to the midline. Okay. All right, then you can play up your screen action. Got you. So used to him being on your body, that you actually want him on your body. No, if he's like that, uh -huh. go. I don't care if I'm not under the screen. Watch, watch how he has to guard it. If he jumps it, I'm going, right? If I just start running off this, he's gotta make a decision. He's most likely from that angle gonna just go under it and then you can shoot this, obviously. Just go, good. I like it. Ah, almost. Oh, you, you're, you're there, you're there with that, but you gotta t punch that dribble quicker. Okay. All right, and then refuse it, again. Good, pull it. Relax, Maddie, set it. All right, guard me. I'm coming off right here, right before the screen. 
stop. Okay. okay, so you're gonna go off it when they trail you. Yeah. All right, since you're a shooter, they're probably gonna go over the top and maybe jump it. So come off of it, right before the screen, you're trailing me, I stop and hit you. And now you're kind of forced, right? Cause you're kind of even with the screen. Mm -hmm. So if I come off of it and he goes under it, go under, now you're gonna stop behind the screen and shoot. He's trailing it, uh -huh. use it, stop here. See how he's under it? You start to go again, he gets caught, you go under the screen, stop behind and shoot. Okay. All right, but he, he's forced to play. So we're here, I'm hitting him here. So he's forced to go under, stop, okay? okay. Back hip, they're gonna trap you, right? Okay. Come, hit him, right up, even, yep. And now he goes under, pull it. Perfect. Use it. Bump. Good. That's an NBA line. You know that. Back hip. Play. Bump. When you play, when you come off the screen, when you when you're playing off the screen, you gotta get creative because all they're gonna do is jump the hell out of you. Okay. They're gonna trap you. Yeah. So you can't just run off screens all the time, like I told you before. So right now, start to use it and then stop. Bump him. Make him make a decision. Slow, so then just slightly step behind him. Okay. All right, again. If you're running off the screen, right? And as you start to go, if you feel like he lo you lose him, huh? that means he's going where? Under. Under, right? So if he starts to leave early, I feel him. I don't need to look at him. Mm -hmm. He's usually attached, so I can just feel him. So I'm looking at the hedger, right. and I'm looking at the third player, maybe in the corner of the wing. So if I start to go and I feel that, uh, that space, that means I could usually stop behind this and pull it. Okay. All right? So that would be without the bump. Gotcha. Okay. Play. Not bad. Good again. Turn it if he's not if he's not going under it. Turn it. Right. Stop. You getting stood up? Get your hips down. Guard me. Right here. Okay. And now I can get here. You're like this. Right. Do it again. Good. Good. Stop. Get lower. You're, tra you're gonna travel like this. Look at me. Uh -huh. You go like this, and you don't get the hip down, this foot's gonna slide. Okay. All right, do it again. Don't start like this, though. You start <laughs> here, and now you're here. Do it again. Mm -mm. Again. Let me see this. From here, here, without the defense. Yep, let's try it. Too fast, again, look at me. There, okay. go, hit, good, again, guard it, body, good, better. Good, body, slow, good. But most players can't go from this position mm -hmm. and then rock their weight like this. So if I'm dribbling here, guard it, I just, right? Okay. Now from there, I can play, open up and go. Okay. Now, yeah, bring your body weight to the left foot. Not bad. Off, bump, go. Pull. Doesn't have to be, okay. it's one option. Yeah. Good. 